good appropriate time of the day to you friends and enemies I am Richard and this whole thing around us why that is LMTDTMFFR or say it with me now limited time offer no vowels and how how are you doing today I hope I hope you are doing well I am doing well he says, having shaken his head and made it sound like he wasn't doing well. I am doing well, but I'm a little tired because I'm an idiot. Oh, excuse me. Um, why am I an idiot? Well, because I read the... I mean... <clears throat> I don't know. How is it? I don't know. How is it? But anyway, I am an idiot because... Oh, I saw the. I saw that uh, Alan Wake, the, the DLC, was coming out today, or my... 22nd, which is now, and I saw it said, oh, one, and I went, aha, cool, they're doing a midnight release, but because of British summertime, it's an hour later, but no, they're doing a midday release, so because of British summertime, it's an hour later, which meant that I was up at 1am and looked at the thing and went, oh, why isn't it updating, because I thought I would, you know, get it downloading and updating before before I would turn in for the night, but no, it in fact won't update for, a, for another five-ish hours. Uh, so yes, slightly tired because I stayed up late to do a thing that I didn't need to stay up late for. If only I had been in any way looking at stuff and working out the difference between AM and P. Alas. Still, I'm feeling okay, all the same. But here we, and yes, that's not what we're here for today. We're here today to look at Windblown. Uh, which is a single word. I hadn't realised that. Okay. Which is the... Um, we're looking at the demo of the next game that the developers of Dead Cells put out. Which is interesting, because I really enjoyed Dead Cells. It was um, an interesting roguelike that they they made there with and it's the first time that I ever openly encountered um, coyote -ing. I hadn't realized that was a mechanic that had been used in games before and coyote -ing is when here is a platform here is your person running along and then they get to the end and then if they go off the end and then you press jump it works as if hey you press jump when you were on the end of it not like oh you just plummet down so he goes, aha, they meant to press jump, but they weren't quite, you know, on par with where the edge of the, the thing was. They didn't get it quite right. So then you can, it will just go, ah, that's fine. We'll let, we'll let you jump from there, which is great. Especially for, you know, I, I mean, I've no proof of it. I assume I'm getting older. I mean, I know I am getting older. I've got proof of that. I assume my reflexes are getting worse. And, you know, I, I have never done a scientific study of how worse my reflexes are getting. But, you know, it must be getting very, very noticeable if I had my younger self here. So, that sort of thing, very useful for me. So, yeah. Hey, there we go. Let's hope they've done a similar sort of thing here in Windblown. Uh, aside from that, I don't think I've got anything important or exciting to uh, bring up right here, right now. So, without further ado, he said, and I went, um, yeah, you're there. Do I go over here? Yes, it is there. Oh, but it's trapped inside the, I can't, I have to all tab out. Oh, sorry about that. Whoop, over we go, so that we can see the thing. All right, and as you can read, welcome to the Windblown Simple Player Demo. Yes, a real demo. About as limited as the mountain's DSL connection. I don't know what the mountain is. I assume it's one of the biomes, which is, you know, the area that you can explore and play in. Hmm, which is interesting because now I'm thinking about it, the first biome of dead cells was maybe, I mean, you could complete it in less than 60 seconds. If you if you did it right, so who knows how much of this is? I mean, it was randomised every time, so you never knew exactly where you were going. 
so you would have to be reasonably lucky to get the 60 second thing going on, but you could do it, still. So I things out, so if your character suddenly takes flight, don't forget, it's probably a feature in the making. Your bravery enjoy an exclusive guinea pig skin as a souvenir. Ooh, a guinea pig. Feedback is the key to making Windblown the best game possible, and we can't wait to see you on October 24th, so two days time. Early access and multiplayer, because yes, this is meant to be a multiplayer roguelike thing. Until then, enjoy the demo! Thanks for joining us, Motion Twin. Who are the people who make it? Not, you know, there are two twins in motion. Alright, and yes, give me that. And I have my controller, so maybe we'll be able to see what upside down controller is like. Right now, wishlist. Alright, okay. I'm pretty certain I've already wishlisted it. I must have done. And look, it, you can change which file, file you're on. Hey, we're on number of exposition zero. Ooh, exciting. And yeah, English, oh, blood effects. See how that looks like a box? Now it's an empty box. That confused me for a while. I was going, what? Why is there no tick appearing in that box? It's because filling in the box is the thing. I don't know what login is. Meh. Oh. That might be because I've got dead cells on GOG and there isn't a login there. So yeah, I don't know. Alright, well. Choose a name. What should we call ourselves? We're gonna call ourselves... Hey! We're gonna call ourselves that. Because... Why wouldn't we call ourselves Wurty? You can just put your finger down and then run it across the keyboard. Oh, let me... There we go, brother. Hey! We have an axolotl, a basilisk, a bat, a guinea pig, or a pangolin. Demo Valiant for reward. Well, we'll try... I mean, I assume that means we can try it from the get-go. So, let's try guinea pig. Why are they uh, animals rather than uh, blobs of cells as they were in dead cells? Or blobs of slime? Awaken! Come! Join me! Hey! There I am! No one, I got a thing on my back. Well, that isn't good. Can I get it off? Or, you know, is that enabling me to do stuff? Alright, well, you're going to tell me how to move? No, I have to figure that out for my own, do I? I'm going to guess it's the left stick. It is! Oh, I can't go into the water. No, that's a dash. Can I actually jump? No, I can dash. I got no jump. That's disappointing. Oh! Ah! There we go. That's how you emote. Oh, I'm so sad that I found out that you can emote in this game. Oh, and there's only four emotes. There's no diagonals. Stop! Don't go that way! I am sad. I cannot go that way. Wind blown. Oh, well there's somebody being blown away by the wind. So you know. That's a thing. Hello. Oh, no, not a way forward. Not a secret hidden thing. And yeah, there were lots of. Or oh, there were quite. There were always secret hidden things in that. Dash! Ah, that is how you get across places. Ah, exciting. And there doesn't appear to be any sort of cooldown on it. I can just do it immediately. Oh! No, I don't want that. Can I go on without it? Oh! Apparently I need it. I mean, I said I didn't want it. It's because when you pick up a weapon in a game, then you can be attacked. But it looks like I can be attacked even without it. Perfect for fish! Good for adventure. Last hit is critical. Yep. So, here we go. Yeah, that's probably it. Yep. So the last hit is a critical. Hello! There you go, and then I got a bunch of stuff. See down there, Wurty has a hundred hit points. Do stuff on X. 
Hello? Thank you. Now, there are pots. Smash. Aha, you can smash them with dash. Dash mash. Hello, giant crystalline. Oh, you can jump. Ow. Yes, I did try to dodge there, but for some reason, didn't let me. I guess I was because I was in the middle of a chain of attacks. There we go. Hey, I can go up and down. I've lost 15. 15 of my precious health. What are you? Can I press all buttons on there just to see if you do anything? Nope. But we saw down we saw something down here, didn't we? Look, there's a down. I guess that's where we're going to? Is that where it's leading us? I mean I can Oh! Well, that is a thing that I didn't realise I could do. I was just pressing it. I guess I should have looked for that ending. That means you can dash across. Alright, okay. And now I can open this chest. Um, it's a thing. A glowing rock. Alright. Oh, now I'm here. Hey, and now that this has opened, because I couldn't open it before, because the enemies were around. Unsurprising, nice simple. Oh, and now we've got another glowing rock. Except this time, I knew it was a glowing rock. Nothing in there. Hmm. Can I? I can. Ah, so even when there are places where you cannot see that ending path, if you can see it, Go over there and try dashing to it. It doesn't feel like you can fall off the end and die. Ah, but I can't go around that, but I can dash over like that. Thank you for telling me. Wish I knew what I was picking up. Ooh, what, what was going on there? Ah, is it because of this? Why, why was I seeing, like, parts? Uh, no, that's a moat again. I was trying to move the camera. I guess it must be, yeah. Although, it doesn't let me see over here. Hmm. Oh well, that's a thing. I got a star, whatever that means. Don't worry, I'm down here. I'm just, you know, being nice. Don't worry. Look at all this water falling down into nothingness forever. Such a waste. Oh. Oh. I dodged it the last second. Did that... Did that get me a special thing? Because it seemed to slow down time briefly or something. And of course it came up with the word DODGED. Hello? Can I go for a dip in the water? It would be lovely. No? Oh. Now here's a thing. Friendly memory. Hey, wait, you're not a sentinel. Yeah, I always want friendly memories to come over and tell me what I'm not. We used to be like you, if we remember correctly, but things didn't end well. Seems to be broken. A shred of memory haunting this mineral? 
If you like, we can help you leave this cursed place. We can share what's left of us with you. Might disturb you initially. Hey, it's better than being trapped here forever, if you ask me. Please choose me. You can only absorb one of us. No, me, free me. Don't listen to them. Take the one that will help you the most. Alright. I mean, I could take none of you. Get a gift from the friendly, the nervous. Oh well. I guess. Oh, right, and here we go. Okay, so now we get to choose. I'll see toggle details. It gives bonus damage for the duration. You can only have one at a time. Always take the stronger effect. Active kills plus sixty percent damage for four seconds. Okay, there's no details there. There's no details there. There's only details on that one. First hit against the target deals 120% damage. Eh, I'm only doing 10 damage with the thing, so 120 is only 12. That's not great. Unless, I suppose, I could miss, miss, and then get the critical, which does 90. Which would be, what's 120% of 90? Um, I mean, it's not 110, it's less than that. It's 10 less, so 9 is 10%, and then 2 is less than 3. He said, doing this in his head, so yeah, about 101. Weapons and trinkets damage. Weapon and trinket damage plus 60% against isolated enemies. So against the last one. So when you get down to the last person, then you do increased damage. No? Or do they just have to be far enough away? No. It is against the very last one. Alright, let's try and do some brutality. Alright. Thank you very much. Still haven't got healing or anything. Open inventory. Ah! Uh -huh. Fish knife. Perfect fish. Good for adventures. And yeah, there's no other gear I can swap with at the moment. I have 43 yellow things, 11 cogs, and 2 glowy stones. And here I have deadly brutality. Okay, I can't. There's no, there's no details for me to toggle. It says toggle details, but I can't. There's nothing. Yeah, 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 I got a thing. Well, that 44. Yeah, that is increased. Ching! It said. All right, and then this. Oh, and the camera loves changing itself. Got anything over here? No, nothing. See, okay. Look at all these floating islands. Is there. Ow! Uh, is there a thing on screen which was telling me where. 40 seconds. Oh, 4 seconds was for that. Encrypted memory, death orb. That doesn't sound uh, ominous at all. But this does feel very Dead Cells like. Because they. they When you first start playing Dead Cells, there are lots of things that you can't activate. It's. I don't want to say it's Metroidvania in that regard, because it's a roguelike, so you have to go through runs multiple times. Yeah, and I didn't see anything on there which told me about brutality. Maybe I'm just meant to be looking at the colours on my person. Because they're all yellow being blown right now. But yeah, there were, there were lots of mystery or... Mysteries is not the right word, because it sounds like you can solve them. And it isn't, it's just the game will, un will tell you about them later. Right, 
let's try and get... No. There we go, I dodged and something happened. Yeah. So, yeah, you can get dodged. Alright, and now that there, there's this thing again. Which I don't know what that is. You use it in, in Dead Cells, the first game, which obviously I'm going to be comparing to quite a lot. You came across, like, things on the floor. It was piles of slime, I think it was. Or was it a seed? I forget. Or And then when you went over and you pressed the action button on it, you just tickled it. Or it gave you a tickly feeling. I forget which. Because it's been so long since I was at that stage of the game. And then you found an item and then when you came back and used it, it made the, the seeds grow into a vine that you could climb, thus getting you to a different part. But yeah, it, it was very much not explained what anything was. Hey! Uh, ow! Wow, I'm dying here. I can do some healing, please. Can you get me a healing vial or something? I assume that's what this is. Because that is very much what it looked like in Dead Cells. A flask of healing. No, I think I'm pretty certain that Dead Cells has Twitch integration as well. So we really should have a look at that and see what it does. I assume it's not good for me. Okay, there's people down there. Can I... Why, why would I want to go out there to do that? But look, okay, there's things down there where we're headed. Hello! No, oh, I should have... Oh, a box. Kunai. Applies curse. Plus 4% each. Held. All curses explode, dealing critical damage. Okay. Which, I was going to say, this is probably going to be... There we go. You could have two weapons in dead cells. Or you could have two item... Two things in dead cells, which could be... A a bow, or a, or a, a melee weapon, or a shield. You could have any combination of those two that you wanted. Um, alright. No, not over there. Down here, I guess? Yeah. Man, I'm so glad that I remember how to teleport, even if I don't remember anything else about me. dodge because I wasn't paying any attention. Oh! Something happened. The thing on my back. And it took me away. And presumably I lose all those weapons and have to start again. Thanks, Perrin. That's it. Kyle is back. Oh no, my name is Kyle. That's, that's not good. I'm here, Master. Ah! Hmm. Another recruit to train then. Hush! Keep it down. At last. Give them time to get back, to get over their emotions. They've only just come back to life. Blah. Hey, you puked on me. Getting killed isn't easy to digest. <laughs> I'll get the mop. Welcome to our Ark. My name is Eberin, head of the village and the Leapers Guild. Seem to have fully recovered. No. Uh, Maccabee. Maccabee? Sean knows how to work miracles in the infirmary. See the thing you're wearing on your back? It's a pulsar. I don't know where you got it, but... 
it's linked to your soul. It's what allows you to come back to life here on the Ark. You were very lucky. And you know, it's linked to a pulsar. I have the pri privilege of becoming a leaper. Leapers, first of all, are here to help the people of the Ark. You bring back precious resources such as cogs found in the vortex sentinels. If you show willingness to help the Ark's inhabitants, I'll make you a new recruit. For starters, can you see Kubrick to the west? Apparently, one of my apprentices brought him a sentinel golem. Don't worry, it's totally harmless, but we can, but we can't get it to work. If you can make it, you'll be one of us. What do you say? At worst, you'll be working with Maccabees. Here you go. Take this flask. It might come in handy. Hey, I have healing. Health flask. Start your expedition with a health flask. Recovers up to 40% of your healing. Now we can get Maccabees bark. Those are flying barks to store Maccabees collection, so you can change your appearance. Don't know what the general. I see. Is that general, as in the general, a person, or general, as in you know, general? And then vortex, as in it is generally a thing. Explore so deeper into the vortex to unlock this content. All right. Oh, and we've got the pulsar. Strange artifact placed on your back. Allowing, allows you to perform evasive dashes and leap from island to island. Alright, well then, give me the health flask. This item is now available for your next expeditions. Start your expeditions with a health flask. Aha, uh -huh. and if I have 200 cogs, I can get health flask too, so I can use it twice. And receive a weapon at the start of your expedition. Do I have 20... Do I have 20 cogs? So yeah, this means general. Okay, so that's healing. Something that's going on at the Ark in particular. Something that's happening at the Vortex and general, generally things. Alright. So now I can see that. Alright, physical rubric at the west of the Ark. Um, I mean, I'm assuming west is... No? Have we gone to see the Broken Sentinel? No? Is this way north? I don't know. Hello. Alright. Oh, I don't have my... Uh, I was trying to use the darts there, but no, I've lost them all and I only have the fish left now. What happens if I break you? Oh, you just rebuild again. Did I ever play Tunic? No, but I'm well aware of what tunic is, so to speak. First he, he, hello, the golem is driving me crazy! Well, we can. I mean, why would you want a scarecrow right here? No, wait, how did, how did I, how did I get that? I'm going to assume that's a thing that I shouldn't be going, shouldn't be happening. Okay, and two glow marks in 25. Do you see any crows? Must be working. That is true. I would really like to be able to zoom in on what that says. Does it say don't eat the cabbages? Does it say cabbages not for you? I don't know. Oh, I can go in the middle. Woo! This golem is driving me crazy! Hey, look, can I? No, I can't use those stairs, apparently. I know how to dash now, but I don't know how to use stairs. That's great. You are the newcomer. I am Kuprick. I'm in charge of restoring all the Ark's broken things. This damn golem is resisting me. I've tried everything, but it seems to be missing a vital component. Perhaps you can find it in the vortex? All you have to do is seek the same model and grab the part in question. Okay. I'm very curious to see what this golem is all about. Find a way to repair friend four three V three R Go in the vortex to get that back, kid. Alright, okay, and what do you have to say? L L O Dollar 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 It's capitalism. I friend, your reader uh, pacifist code P one three C 
three um oh missing piece missing code piece missing I should have read that recovery attempt Booting error assistance required missing original ventricle friend is offline Friend Heaver? Is that.? Hmm. No, that doesn't make sense. Alright. If I hit it on the head, yeah. Nope, you can't hit it on the head. I mean, Tunic was all about exploration and discovering what was going on. And Dead Cells, which again. No, you have to do a set on expedition to find the missing piece. It is is very much about repetition and going through the same things again and again and again. Whereas Tunic was a single continuous adventure. And while it does share, you know, some of the characteristics just because it's a cutesy animal. But yeah, it's not It's not that. Anyway. No, you have to do a self on expedition to find the missing piece. Right. I can unlock a starting weapon. Receive a weapon at the start of your expedition. Presumably, I don't have anything unlocked other than the fish knife at the moment, but I, I don't have anything else to spend my 25 gogs on, and I've got no idea how how many I will get in a thing, but you know, let's do it. So the item is now available for your next expedition, starting weapon. One, you will receive a weapon at the start of your expedition. Cool. I was going to say, oh, no, I was going to say, there'll probably be something else. Ah, but now I can get these. Ah, because those are unlock one of the things. Right, okay, so in order to do that, I need to unlock another one. And this one, I need to unlock two more things. Right, okay. I thought it was a level or something. Like, I need to be level one and I'm currently level zero, but no. All right, backstab to plus 25. That'd be great. Here we are. I have a starting weapon coming with me. Whatever that is. Whee! So you found a way to repair the Sentinel Gone? No, I haven't yet. I guess this is taking me to... Yeah, and that is taking me into the Vortex. But what's down over here? Ah, I can just lie down and relax here. Oh, hello. There's, there's a cog over there. 25 cogs. Alright, there's just 25 cogs for exploring. That's fine. Hey! And now I'm on top of somebody's house. Nope. And now I'm on top of somebody else's house. And now... There's a, a, a wind. Oh, hey! Presumably, this will be where I... Well, maybe it won't be where I unlock weapons, but you know. Hello. I don't know, maybe someone will be up here. Alright. Let's just look at that. Wow, look at all that stuff that I'm doing. That is of no use whatsoever. Begin expedition. Look, here's Vomito, says Kyle. I bet they gave you your first mission after you got blasted by the vortex. Lol. You were alpaca. What's more, you don't even know how to use the cannon. Roll from the wall. Or rolling on the floor, loving my ass off. I mean, I didn't need to. It's so simple, you just have to get into it. But seeing as you have only two brain cells. Ah! Alright, so I guess I need to rescue you. I'm coming to help you, person who I don't really care for and vomited on. Alright, okay. Ah, oh, and here's my weapon. I could have, rather than the fish knives, I could take backstab steal critical damage, held dash behind your target. I don't quite know what you mean by held. I s ah! Alright, hold down the attack key. Alright, okay. But you have you have no held things. All right. Well, let's try. Presumably, you're much weaker. 
70 DPS, 80 DPS. All right, well, let's give it a go. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Presumably, some of the currency that I'm, some of the things that I'm getting here. is uh, like currency I can spend in the run and not to upgrade the run back up the base. You guys are all too fast for that. Can't really get behind you. Anything over here? Can't really get behind you and start doing backstab damage. I mean, maybe I could do it with you, but. Ow! Forty percent is forty healing. I think I'm going to swap it back. I go up there. Why can't I go over there? That looks great over there. I want to go and look at the trees. And you know, I haven't been to the toilet at all. So... That sure would be nice to know. Can I go behind the waterfall? Ah ha ha ha! Secrets! Another glowing rock. Da na na na! It's almost like I have played a video game before. And so I thought there might be something hidden behind there. I wonder if there was anything on... I mean, we found the one on the first one. Hello. Come on. No. Oh, you're angry at me. I'm jumping way early. I'm gonna waste the three healing points. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, uh, B. No. I have to hold it. Hold it. Okay. I guess maybe. Oh, if I'd known that, I wouldn't have done it. I would have, you know, waited until the next thing where I had, presumably, a healing aura. Or something. Because now it's all the way over there. Hello. You opened. Another glowy rock that I have no idea what it does. Is the healing aura still here? No, it's gone away. I don't know whether it was time-based or because I started a new fight on a new area. <sighs> so I can deposit 30 health in there and get a Raven Blade, which deals criticals after the third strike. And if you hold it, you do a jump attack. All right. I'll take damage and have that. Here's the Raven Blade. And I will swap it for the uh, fish knife. Well, oh, there's a sort of jumpy attack, eh? So I can get straight behind you if I just... Cool. But I mean, that used up 30 of my health. And I've already used my healing pod for the, the thing. Oh, no. Oh, mysterious box. Hey, hello! Burn Aura, an encrypted memory. 
presumably those are things that I can unlock. Like, if I get to the end. Can I leap over? Uh, that's where I came from. Onwards. Oh! I wasn't paying any attention to where the, the fact that it was an explosive. That was silly of me. Did you see I jumped behind you because I remembered I had that ability. Seven golden. Ah, hello. You're a thing that I can probably get. Yeah, there we go. A crystal. Oh no. Okay, kunai. So apply curse, and then if I hold it, all curses explode. All of them explode. Hmm. It might be nice to have a ranged weapon. Okay, so one, two, three, four, six, five, six. So four percent for each one of those I apply, is it? Is that how that works? Oh look, there's a mysterious thing there which makes me think I can like teleport through it or something. Look at that beautiful water thing that I cannot get anywhere close to. Oh, another one! Oh, also detected. Yeah, that's me. Alarm, please do not destroy me. I'll be here forever. Be here forever. For. Oh, friend forever, then it will be, won't it? Yeah. Is in pass is a pacifist mode. Please have a friendly attitude when using BF forever. Be here forever is here to help you. I'm not sure you are. Yeah. Be here forever can satisfy your request. Code piece missing. Warning, the operation is irreversible. We hope we have met your expectations. Take care of friend. Oh no. No. Kill it, kill it now. We did. It's not here anywhere though. That's a shame. But we did, we killed it. Oh, here's a purple one, whatever that means. Oh, I spontaneously generated rocks. Because I did my... Oh, I didn't spontaneously generate rocks on this side. Interesting. Oh. Why are there no rocks over here? Why are there only rocks on this side? Oh, I'm making... Okay, I'm making rocks wherever it happens to land on, on like, the platform. An invisible platform is there. Oh no! Looks like there is a boss over here. Or maybe not a boss, but a thing. Oh my god. Hey, explode it. Yeah. yeah! I think you're fully cursed. Oh! I did not... I was too... I was too... Uh... Hey! Oh, I only did. Oh, no! No, 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 no. And then I died again. Oh, because I was too busy trying to be 
Cursey person. Cursey person. I was too busy trying to curse them. Ah, am I going to vomit again when I come out? Yep, well that's not great. I don't like that. Ah, but I've got the core. I see you didn't come back empty handed to take this, the broken golem. I can't buy any of these. But I gained 23 doing it. Going around. So, you know, can I can I actually put any... Not enough cogs. Alright. Collect them during the settles and during the expedition. In, uh, I mean, again, comparing this to dead cells, in dead cells, you would have, like, things that you could unlock, but you could put some of your cells towards it as you went along. So, while this says 200, now you have to earn 200 in order to unlock it. Whereas before, you if you had 50, you could say, I'm going to put these 50 in here, and then you would only need 150 more when you came along. Yeah? I was just curious if you could do that. Alright, friend! Alright, now we can fix this piece of junk. I mean, yes. Give the ventricle to the sentinel golem. Ventricle detected. Analysis of previous holder. Known holder! Drying of the ocular device now in progress. Yep, best friend, BF forever. Died. Restoring factory settings. Hello, my name is Fred Forever. I'm your personal encrypted memories decryptor. I decode these encrypted memories and send them to the pillars inside the vortex. Once decrypted, you can find them using our memory pillars. Excessive use of memories is dangerous for your health. To decrypt, please find an encrypted memory. Warning, decrypting memories requires memonites. Material not included. Thank you for your trust. We're giving you your first decryption souvenir. A beat bolt. A unique f fusion between precision crossbow and thrilling rhythm game. Woo! We hope we have met all your expect expect that. We hope we have met all your expectations. Please consider giving us five stars on Grand Forever is offline. All right. Oh no! I can't have a death over a burn order. And whoops! Sorry about that. I have not my thing. Explode and apply fire burn. And then give burn infusion to all allies in your area. Because yes, this is a multiplayer one. Death Orb repeatedly damage foes in its path. Here we have Beat Bolt. Fire with the right timings to inflict criticals. Katars, Kunai, Raven Blade, Assassinate, Duelist, Deadly Brutality. All of these are ones which we have unlocked and can potentially find. With the exception of Fish Knife, which we will always have. In the game. As we go through. Alright, Pete Bolt. That was now available for your next expeditions. Fire with the right timing to inflict criticals. Can't unlock these ones, not in demo. Hell Everin, the friend has been repaired. Have you encountered the memories I've unlocked? No, not at all. If I understand correctly, this friend forever uploads decoded memories to the pillars inside the vortex. It's a bit like escorting lost people back home. Using your pulse all to absorb these new memories will make you even stronger. Oh! It's here! Am I with the right timing to inflict criticals? Alright, what's the right timing? Oh, I see. I mean... that difficult because no there's no cogs up there this time I mean it wouldn't be. but that's fun we'll take it around and see how we do you got anything more did you succeed Eperin, I hear you repaired the golem. I'm proud of you, recruit. Or should I say, you grunt? Ha <laughs> ha! I'm using friend forever. Will be crucial. 
to the future of the Ark's inhabitants. Now that you're one of the Leapers, I'm giving you this Rescue Fish! Allows you to rescue survivors from the Vortex during future expeditions. Remember, the more victims we repatriate, the more the Ark will develop. Good luck, Runk. Come back to me if you make any more interesting discoveries. Alright. Now explore the Vortex for survivors and additional memories. Well, I mean, given how I have been going... It'll be a long time before we find any, uh, explorers. No, 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 oh, I put it to you. Yes. Oh, and I could take that. Um... No, thank you. I'm happy with my thing and my... My rhythm game. Anything over behind me? Look, I mean, look, there's a waterfall down there. There must be a secret hidden in there. No? Ooh, I want my secrets. I don't see any rescue fishes up here. I've got a fish knife. Maybe I should gut the rescue fish. because I don't actually want to rescue anyone, particularly not Kyle. Bleh, who wants to rescue Kyle? I wonder if I can just sit over here and do this. I'm not allowed to jump. That's cheating. He said having cheated. Okay, so we've got two different paths now. Alright, well let's go behind the waterfall. I would like the raven thing, thank you. I don't need to aim this at all. It just does its thing. Hello? Level 2 guitars. No, thank you. Follow the wind. What are you talking about? Oh! It teleports me back. Oh, okay. Does that mean every other time that I encountered one of those yellow things? Hmm. I mean, that is better. Uh, Alright, I'm gonna swap it. I mean, I can always swap back. Oh! Look at me, I was flying then for a second. Woo! Alright. Does that mean that every other time I missed a, a secret? Because that would be disappointing. Hello. I teleport behind you. And then I did. See, look, here's a yellow thing. Why? Why is there a yellow thing? Where is this secret? Or maybe it's potentially there is a secret around here. But, you know, maybe there isn't. Or, you know, maybe it is. No. No, there's nothing. I can't go behind these waterfalls. Or I'm not pressing in exactly the right direction to go behind those waterfalls. Or behind those waterfalls is something, and I am pressing incorrectly. Oh, you jumped! <laughs> nah. Alright, I, I broke all of those. I don't know that I want my progress to carry over. I'm not a big fan of that. If hello,
I would like to start again from the beginning. When we uh, get to that bit. Uh, come on, there's clearly something over there. I mean, I'm just going to have to go up to come down again. I was trying to make use of that and follow the wind, not to just randomly shoot out there. Although, you know, randomly shooting out there is also a good thing. Do you count as a thing? No, you don't. Okay, here's a thing to open. What can we find? Memonite dust. Alright. Behind the waterfall. No. Uh... I wanted to go behind the waterfall and find an exciting thing. I also want to be able to go behind this waterfall. No? Alright. I'll just smash pots instead then. Hey, can I? No, I can't. Oh wow, look how stylish you are sometimes. Do you get... Okay. One, two... So yeah, every third one is stylish one-handed crossbow holding. Presumably doing killing more damage. Ah, we're here! Well, I would have preferred... Oh. Hello. Ow. Ow! Hey! I mean, I can just do that. Ow! Uh, oh well, I'll take it. Oh, I was trying to take a drink, but I forgot that I needed to hold it. Hey! Alright, I'll just do that instead, alright? Unlock, altar attack. That's a thing. Altar attack, use one weapon until the uh, signal appears, then use another weapon to launch its altar attack. Okay. Oh! Well, that was cool. Ah! Bleed infusion. And then just a giant thing. Alright, well, can, can you go away now? No? Alright, I guess you're there forever now. to find a way to spend, you know, the gold stuff that I'm finding. Although maybe that is not in the demo. Oh, am I in for you? Okay, so yeah, I can make you bleed with my bleed infusion, I see. Ow! Looks like I'm going to die, because I don't have any healing. Because I used all my healing to, you know, defeat the big bad thingy. Hello, are you friend? No. You're here for Sneak one thing and then bed. And you only want one thing and it's disgusting. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> ah, I died while I was swiveling. Damn. I mean, that's really what I want to be able to do. Just swivel around while in the middle of the game. But alright. Ah, I will do a better swivel now. Seeing as I died. 
Loud noises. I mean, bleh, as we've just seen, that's uh, a thing which is going on. So, bleh, bleh, bleh. do you have enough cogs? Of course not. Looks like a roguelike. It is indeed. If you've ever played Dead Cells, then this is the follow-up, or this is the the game that the the makers of that are producing next, or the developers are developing next. So yeah, and it um uh, it appears to be multiplayer as well, or at least that is the aim. It comes out. It's in the Steam Next Fest now, so you've got like nine hours or something in in which to uh, play it before the demo goes away. Well, having said that, maybe the demo won't go away in that, but anyway, and it goes into early access on the 24th. You remember hearing about this, you had no interest in the last game and don't have any interest in this. Really? <laughs> well, um, I could buy Macabre's Bark. Mac Maccabees. Maccabees. So you can change your appearance. Ooh. Or I could uh, wait and get another 70, uh, 27, and then we could unlock backstabs. So backstabs will do plus 25% damage, which I assume is things. And hey, we've got auto attack. Use one until you can get to a second. And now, where for you? Aren't you guys to know? Good luck, or we're all counting on you. I mean. Thank you, but you shouldn't count on me, as we have seen. I have died repeatedly. Agamie just returned. She's near the infirmary. You should go and talk to her. Ugh, that smell. Ray told her it was a bad idea to leave corpses under a top all in the sun. Alright. Oh, now we have variant bait. Attracts variants that may appear in your expeditions. Killing them will provide additional loot. So I can make the game harder for myself. Huzzahs! Alright. And I presume this is it? Yes, it is. Hello, young leaper. I'm back with a fresh load. If you wish, you can change bodies. Yes, yes, you heard me correctly. The resurrection machine can return you to a body of your choice. All you have to do is choose one from one of my findings. Yes, like this. Pangolin, guinea pig, bat, basilisk, axolotl. Well, we are the guinea pig. Let's be an axolotl right now. Eh. Yeah. Alright, well, there we go. We'll go around as the axolotl. Yeah, have you got something for me? No, I haven't. I am interested. Hello. Every database has been updated. Okay. So... Presumably the glowing that I'm earning is not going to be able to unlock anything then. Alright. Tell we'll move the train down and get the other end of the arch again. Oh, I don't have my uh, thing anymore to shoot you with. Hello, anything down here? I assume more stuff will be unlocked as we get along. Or as the game progresses. We begin expedition! Hey, yes, I like the Raven Blade. We will definitely have that. Um, and we're going to swap. Oh, we're going to swap that around. Thank you. Oh. Oh. Interesting. What's the other one? <laughs> Furious arts there. All right, okay. Alternate attack. get to trigger off the alternate attack or alter attack uh, 
As I had hoped I would. But all right. Hello. Try to trigger it too early. So I'm wondering if maybe I should go for that, because that's only three strikes. And then I do it. So yeah. Let's try out that. I mean I know it's only a fish knife, but still. Hello. Yes, I know you saw me. Oh, you were dead before I even needed to do my ultra attack. Ooh, how dare you be so easily defeatable. I mean, if you weren't easily defeatable, I would of course be complaining about how dare you not be easily defeatable, but still. You get the point. Right. Oh, I could also do that, of course. Forgetting, of course, about the, the held attack that I had. Uh, can't get over there. Hello, everybody! Oh, ow, I... Ow! Ow! That's what happens when you uh, jump too early. Oh, and then I could have. Yeah. There we go. Okay, so there's still some healing left. All right. But it won't be any good to me because it will go on. It will disappear. Right? Yeah, it's gone. Oh. This time we have a... I don't know. A dash mark. Well, presumably, if I dash through a thing, it will mark it. You know, so I can do extra damage or something. Yay! And there's hidden things, hidden things. Go over there where all the water is. Look at all this water that I should be able to go over and see. Man, so many things to be smashed. Hey, let me in that behind there. Oh, hello. Oh, you're not a friend. Oh, you're definitely not a friend. Died to the Raven Sword before I could get to the alternate slashes. One, two, three, four, five. Alright. Five hits with it. Alright, where am I? Ah, down over here. Stop having explosives. Hey, I dodged you. Alright, well, there we go. I did a thing. Can I jump in there? No? I want to go in those holes and see what's behind them. It reminds me of, um... Jedi Survivor, for some reason. I don't know why. I just want to go in those holes. Oh, have we got different... 
No, they're still the same sort of things. But now they've got axolotl faces rather than uh, guinea pig faces. Oh, that was me trying. I thought I was holding down the Y key, but I was holding down the X key because I'm an idiot. There we go. More mimonite dust. Sure would like to be able to find somewhere to spend. Well, I guess this, I'm only going to be able to spend my goldy things at the end of the level. Oh! <laughs> Speaking of, hey, and I can use it to heal 20% of my HP, which I really could do with. Oh. There we go. Mmm, yum 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 yum! Can I go? Oh, I can't jump onto those, which I have previously used as platforms. Alright. Hello. Interesting. Are you invincible? thing. We get some Memonite dust and can choose one of the three memories. Oh, these are all me. I hadn't realized that before. I couldn't tell from the angle. Or, you know, I wasn't looking well at them. Yeah. These are all different bodies of me. Axolotl! If I sit against the target, there's 120. Kills activate brutality. Kills heal you for 4%. I need the healing. So, necromancy it is. I mean, who doesn't love a bit of necromancy? And when I say that, I don't mean... <clears throat> Going all the way back... To, to when I first remember encountering it in a game and going, hey, this is not what I wanted. That is Diablo 2 that I first really remember it in. And that was the necromancer in that. And it wasn't really necromancy. It was just summoning under a different name. Because you just summoned bad things. There was an additional requirement, yes. But, you know, it was summoning. It wasn't... It wasn't... ...do things. There we go. It was, oh, boost. That's new. Yeah, it wasn't... It wasn't necromancy. It was summon things with a necromantic skin. Which was disappointing. Oh, so critical damage do plus 10%. Damage is just generally plus 5%. Or shells looted by the team, plus 10%. Hmm. Hmm. I'm going to have general damage up by 5%. There we go. General damage. Increased. I presume, I presume, because Dead Souls very much has a similar thing where you can take additional stuff like that. I presume the the Twitch integration allows other people to choose for you. 
rather than you having it. I mean, that would be it. And then, I don't know, maybe I can occasionally spawn in a monster or send you a message or something? Like, like you could with the um, Twitch integration of uh, uh, Cult of the Lamb. Hey, that killed two of you at once. Oh, that killed, that, sorry, that killed one of you, and... That killed one of you, and did damage to the other one, that's what I meant. Ooh! Yeah, let's try that out, replacing the fish knife. That is still going to do the giant bolt. This is going to still going to do that. All right, okay. Um, I want you to be my primary. All right, yeah. Switch does plus thirty percent damage. Oh, so okay. So Plus seventy percent damage. Plus thirty percent damage. All right, okay, fun. No, um, replace that one. So now I have the right one. All right, now where do I go? Where is the way off of this? How do I get out of this chicken shit outfit? Over here. Nope, there's a thing down there. Alright, thing down there. Oh, there's two things down there. Oh, dang. Hey, you took... You died entirely. So did you. And now I can have... Oh, I can have kunai. Um, let's see what you do if I replace the bolt with you. Oh. You just fire off a lot immediately. And you still do that. I think I'd rather have that so that I can explode the curse. Yeah. Yeah, I want to get over there. No, all right, I'll go this way instead. Oh, hello, everybody. running away and uh, retreating to better islands so that I could just get ranged attacks on everybody, but hey, it worked. And that's all that matters. I mean, I guess if I don't... Get, ah! Oh, you can have ten. Was it always ten? I thought it was six when some of the earlier ones. Oh, I did not dodge that. Oh well. On the plus side, I did gain the 4% health back. There's stuff up here. Oh, this is the same place. No, wait, there's a... No, okay. Ah! Stop doing that. There we go. You all got smashed. 
And then there's a thing over here. What do we get? Duh. See, I mean, this is one of the reasons why I would like I would have a. would want to reset it, because I don't want all this Memonite dust. I mean, it's nice to have it. Absolutely. But, I'd want to start from the beginning again. Because, ooh. This is a trinket, and I can use the trinket sometimes, can I? Okay. Cool. Yeah. Okay, so it does that around there, and then it's got a cooldown of time. All right. Okay. Cool. Or you know, great. Because yeah, I wouldn't want to suddenly. Oh, I can unlock all of these things immediately. Because I don't know if that would it carrying over might. If I feel might diminish the, the the early access nature of the game or because, oh, you've unlocked all these things, but now all these things have changed. Or have disappeared. Uh-oh. Well, hello. Trinket ready. All right. Well then, Trinket. Go. Oh, I haven't got healing? Have I used my healing? Did I... When did that happen? Are you gonna explode? When are you... Oh, ow! Okay, you explode when I walk over you, that's cool. Trick it. Ah! No, I died again when I got to the boss. Alas. Or oh, I assume that is the boss. Felt very boss-like. Back again. Yeah, am I going to vomit again? No, thank you. I don't like that. So what am I finding set your eyes? Yeah, we'll try a basilisk this time. Woo! Oh no, we've, we've all got, got the axolotl faces. I'm just... That's a shame. Hey there, I know coming back to the art makes me want to puke, but at least you're alive again. Oh, but I could, if I, only I could have... 107 more, I could have two health flasks. Which, you know, wouldn't help me at all because I will have forgotten that I have two health flasks and not used them. You got anything you can unlock for me? Oh, look, memory. There's one more memory to meet. Not in demo. Dash mark. Burn aura. Death orb. I'm just going to assume that I cannot get anything else ever again. And that these things that I'm finding are not in demo ever. And that all the memorite I'm gaining is just, you know, worthless. Um, I will have guitars. Not quatars, but guitars. Pressing the wrong key. I was standing there waiting. Why am I dodging behind you? It's because. Oh. Yeah. Because I couldn't do that. But what? What is? Bleeding for you. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Of course. I saw that before. I just forgot. Looking out for secrets. Secret. 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 Oh. Presumably, bleeding does something to you. Or makes you somehow take damage over time. Enemies. But everybody is dying at the moment before I can get there because. You know. Because they're, they're weaker than these weapons. No, not over there. Oh, Alright, okay. Ah, uh, you're already. 
already dead, so bleeding fusion does nothing. Oh, hello everybody. Okay, here you got one bleed. Does it does it trigger when I get to like a huge number or something? He didn't appear to be taking loads of damage there. So I don't know. Instead of the fish knife. But, but, that's the way we came, isn't it? Yeah, this is the way we came. But, we're gonna have to swap those around. Like that. Now we can. And yeah, that will just get a lot. Oh, okay, can I? Can I dash past you? Oh, I can dash over here, like, round it. Yes, of course. Hello, I'm just gonna run away and do all this. Yeah, see, you only need six. Or maybe, every, maybe it suddenly built up. Maybe it did six and then suddenly built up and I did not notice that. Hmm. Maybe it only needs. Maybe it goes up to ten, but when it has enough that you could kill it, it says, "Hey, you're entirely cursed." I don't know. No, it, it is ten. I'm just not paying any attention. We. Up here, no, okay, onwards then. Hello, haha, I dodged. Uh, and the beat bolt, far with the right timings. No, I don't want that. Thank you very much, but no, thank you. Oh, well, we'll have whatever this is. More Memon and the Night Dust. See, yeah, I feel that that, in early access... Oh, for 40? Team's Curse reduce... Team's Curses reduce foe damage by 2% per stack, and by 40% during Final Curse. I mean, I have weapons that do curse, but that really doesn't sound like a a decent thing. So no thanks, I'm not going to trade in 40 health for that. No? No. I mean, thank you for the option, I guess. Exactly sure I could tell where behind you when you were a ball was when I did my jump. Oh, what, what are you? Are you a? Ah, yes, you are a trinket. Yeah, I was gonna say you sound like a trinket rather than an item. Hello, I would like to trinket you. Oh, that covered an area. That was cool. Finding 
secret areas is just going to be a process of I go over and I dash everywhere. That, 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 that's not. That doesn't feel great because it's just. Alright, okay. Oh, you're. Ha ha ha, you got good. But yeah, it, it doesn't feel great that that is it. The beat bolt again. I don't want beat bolt. I wish I could. Oh, that was an upgrade, wasn't it, in Dead Cells? I was just thinking, I wish I could turn them into money. I just went over and went, oh, I don't like this, so I turn it into like the cod shells in this. But that was an upgrade you had to get, and you only got like 10% of the value. Until you upgraded it, and then you could have 20%, and then you could get 40, 30%, etc, etc. Hello everybody! I don't want to be here. There we go. Are you going to die? No, you weren't on the goo platform. Alright, and now we have... I don't know. Encrypted memory, burning trinkets. Presumably, whenever you use a trinket, you also gain the burning trait. Which I guess is, is like bleed, but better. In that it will do damage immediately? I don't know. I mean, I'm just randomly guessing. Trink it up! Hey everybody! Just, you know, continually die due to my uh, trinkets rather than me actually doing anything. Go behind that one. No, I can't. Uh -uh. Oh, I didn't have them. Pick it up. I was just, I was just saying. I don't have the trinkets. Now I do. There we go. Oh, and we got a boost. Trinkets refill faster. Critical damage plus ten percent. Max refill speed increases 60. Okay. Critical damage or maximum health. Ooh. I mean... I think I'm going to take the maximum health. If I was playing this... properly, I would take the trinket refill because I'm using the trinket all the time. But as I am just doing this, you know, until we get to the first boss, I'll take the maximum health up because after the demo then it will end uh, uh, after the end of the first boss so you know it doesn't really feel like I need to plan long term and get better I mean I do need to get better obviously but yeah hello oh money Memories? Dust? I don't know. Seems to be a decent sized demo. Yes! It's this whole first area and the village. But, as you can see, they've, they've looked off lots of the stuff that you do come across. I presume, because that one has a, um, a skull on it, it is a... Um, and eat a harder boss fight or whatever it is beyond there. I'm, I'm gonna... Right, that is definitely money. I don't know what that is. I would like to be able to see. And presumably there are three. So that you can't just have... Like, if you're doing this multiplayer, the first person can't just immediately go, I run over and stand on top of that thing! And now everybody has to go this way because I said we're going this way. Ha 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 ha. So I don't know, maybe there are going to be two boxes or three boxes and it will be majority wins. I don't know. Um, I don't want to make things harder for myself, although I really am interested in what that is over there. 
So I'm gonna go this way. I don't need the money. I've got 337, so yeah. And yeah, now I cannot go past these ones. Okay, cool. I understand the mechanics. Hello everybody, I will try and beat you and then you will give me stuff. So first things first, everybody be good. There we go. Oh, dang! You swapped! That isn't right. things. Go away. I don't even die. Oh. Oh. I keep forgetting I need to hold it down in order to do it. I should have done that earlier. That would have helped. Wow, that did not help. Okay, no, this is memory, so I don't know what the other one was then. Hmm, alright. Well, I'll get a gift. Press it against the target, does 120. When hit, creates an explosion that stands for it, deals 400%. Oh, when I get hit. Right, okay. Dash activates focus, plus 60% for one hit. Yes, absolutely. That is a thing that I will work because I definitely dash. Hey, I'm focused. Follow the wind. Where am I? Oh, I'm... I've done... right. I see. Okay, I got to the place. Hello. First of all... oh, come on! decent length demo because I'm bad at things. You know, that is also a thing. Don't throw up. That is... Uh, do it once, but then, you know, get better. Hmm, how annoying. I'm running out of axolotls. Uh, Alright, well, we'll have a bat this time. Woo, I'm a bat! Do, you have, do we have enough of cogs? Of course not. Well, I could buy backstabber. Yeah. Alright, that is now available for your next expeditions. Cool. You'll be able to unlock this right at the launch of the early access as you can't save files carried over. Oh, because I pressed the thing in the way. Right, that is not what I meant to do. But look at all these new things which have become available because I've done them. Abundant jars. Broken jars sometimes can name food. Oh, very nice. Okay, and this is a, a just a general thing. Okay. But yeah. So if I now hit you from behind. Yeah, 13. Look at that. And 105. That's great. You're still not going to be giving me anyway, anything, are you? No, not in demo. That's fine. Alright. Now, if I can find where the back of that giant swirly thing is, maybe I can do it. Maybe I can deal with it. Hey, yes, please. Golem Gardens. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Gonna 
try to find my way out of here. Ah, oh my god. Immediately gets hurt. Come on down here, please. There we go. Anywhere? No, alright. Onwards. this waterfall? No, nothing behind that waterfall. Alright. Stupid waterfalls. Kills heal you for 4%. Yes. I'll deposit all of that. Because then that will get me healing. So now I only need to kill 10 things in, without dying in order to, you know, have paid for it. And then 11 for it to make sense to have done it. Oh, how about I remember I can do the giant thing? Yeah. There we go. There's two. Oh, a goo dodge. Okay, cool. So I will leave a trail of goo whenever I dodge, if I had unlocked that, which, you know, isn't a thing. Is that the only place I can go? Ah. Can you come down here? You can. Excellent. There we go. There's more. So that's five that I've killed. Yourself. Mm -hmm. Oh. Oh, what? I. A thousand points of damage from a single hit. There was absolutely no way I was going to survive that, eh? Hey. I've only got a health of 100. You know what, I want the stairs a bat because I don't know what the hell happened there. Alright, I can't get any of you, so onwards. So we'll do this again. Ah, and I'd like to have a look at the whatever the last one was. Was it Wolf? Seagull? I forget. Oh my... Just finish me off. I did horribly. I'll have nothing from that. Skip. Also skip. Also skip the, the throwing up. Why why would I want to be throwing up every time? Pangolin, that was it. We'll be a pangolin. Ooh, look at that. Big old tail. It's the same thing! Hopefully I don't make the same mistake. And one of the good things about Dead Cells was that it was... is that you could, you could do a run and then you could stop. 
that, you know, it was very good for not five minute games, but you know, something you could stop whenever you wanted. He said, not hinting that he was going to stop soon. But yeah, that was certainly a thing. Because it was, it's the nature of the game. You do, you do a run, and you could stop at any point during the run, or any safe space during the run, and you know, let's pick up again. I can stop whenever I want to. Yeah, exactly. Look, man, it doesn't control me. I control it. All right. Oh, what is with this weird camera? where they, it suddenly goes, oh, I need to show you these things, and then sometimes it doesn't. Like, now, why is it doing it? Is it because... I mean, look, I can go under here, and look, we can see that briefly that it goes, hey, we see you, because you've got an outline there, but then then it goes, nope, now, we can, now we're going to expo ex uh, expand the area so that you can actually see. What, why? why? Why have that? Why have two different things going on there? It feels really weird. Oh! That was me being silly, but that one I don't mind because it wasn't right at the beginning. Stop beating him, he's already dead. And then there's um Bloodborne? Is it Bloodborne or Dark Souls? The white part of the uh, the white part of the waterfall is encoded as blocking another view to do things bad if you the blue part of the waterfall does. <laughs> maybe. Maybe. But yeah. Um Dark Souls or Bloodborne. One of them, you talk to somebody through a door, and then when you open the door and go inside, there's just a skeleton sitting in this chair, and it says, already dead! And it's just... It's just such a weird mean. Okay, critical refill. Uh, every third attack is a critical with the fish... fish wife. Fish knife, not the fish wife. Oh, thank goodness, that would that would certainly be a thing, eh? Yep. I went on an adventure, and all I took with me was this fish no wife. Don't worry about it. Oh. I guess that must have been me in the middle of things. In the middle of it. And again! Come on up here. Just jump. Just jump. Oh, no, not like that. See, I was just going to do that and finish you off. Uh, let's take the boost first of all and see what it does. Plus damage, plus critical damage, plus attack speed. Bloodborne. Well, I should take this confirmation as your next late Bloodborne. I uh, will take the damage there. Um, I don't think that is should be confirmation that you take. 
because Bloodborne is... it's not on PC? Oh, at least I don't think it is. It tries to remember. Oh, Kunai. And... well, we'll open this first of all. Oh, loads of money. Okay, cool. Ranged weapon is good, but I do like the fact that I can do only three and then I can go straight into that. Or as before, it's one, two, three, four. Oh. Yeah. But then I do have that. Oh. I think I'm leaving the kunai behind in this instance. Right now, this way. That is what you mean. Your arrows on the ground. Hello! No, that didn't kill you. I thought that killed you. There we go. Hey! It's best trinket I have found so far! Goo bomb! And what did you say you did for four seconds? How much damage? Inflicts goo and damage as well. Just inflicts goo. So I guess, as it says, 56 DPS damage per second. That inflicts 56 times four. Yeah. Oh, 300 shells would get me a health flask recharge. He was 60% of your HP. I thought it was only 40. But well, alright, yes. Definitely. about it everybody. I'm, oh, I definitely don't want to... Oh, god damn it. I just stood there in front of it like I was... Oh, and now I... Oh, slowed. That's what that is. I mean, I saw the things, but I, it was the bomb that caused the slow, which is something I did not know before. Like that. Oh, which makes. Oh, come on! You. You showed me that thing, and then you went, Yeah, I'm gonna fire. I'm gonna jump all the way up there, and then you didn't. That, that is cheating. Or, you know, making me believe things which aren't in evidence. showed me that you were going to jump all the way up here, and then you didn't. I demand a recount. Well, no. Let me not say that. Because that has different connotations now. I demand... Oh! Okay, so I need to stand on this. And then something will happen. Never mind, I'm sure I can do it. Yes, well, yes, don't say that. Exactly, yeah. Do not say the thing. Uh, Cog looted plus 20%, goo duration plus 100%. Yes! Focus stack. 
Nope, enduring goo. Seems I have goo, and I've forgotten to use my goo all the time that I have had this goo. Hello. Be gooed immediately. I mean, I wonder if I can just run around you. For all this time. Until my goo comes back. Uh oh. Alright, well, if I can set off all those bombs, that'd be great, because then... Uh oh Drink it up! Hey, hey, you've been good! Uh oh Standing too close to it. Ah, no! You, you explodey thing. Right, go around, set off all of these things as quickly as possible, so that they're not here. Uh oh Then, when you do that... There we go. Oh, oh no, you're gonna do... You're not gonna do leg stamps. But you are gonna be good. We We did it! We did it! And I've only got three health left, I don't know where I left the health. Because the last time I looked, I had 23. Encrypted memory, heavy blade. Yeah, okay, cool. I could do with... Well, we'll find out. Oh, something happens. What, why, why is there explosions? Well, whatever. Drink it up! Oh, healing! <sighs> I mean, this really feels like the end of the level. <sighs> what was that? Phoenix Rising. That was it. I was trying to think, oh, the one with the, the Greek mythology which had pools like this in it. I played the demo of that. Did I play the, the the game as well? I can't recall. It's an Ubisoft game, so, you know, we don't talk about it anyway. Woo! Oh, hello! No, you don't want to talk to me. And this is where I can spend it. I can buy... Memonite dust. Memonite dust. Or Memonite dust. Well, I don't want any of that. Why well, could it? I, do you want to say anything to me? No. Oh look, there's a, there's a weapon up there. Hmm. Ah. Nope. I can't go over there. I wonder if. No, okay, I can get up here. I want to destroy those balls that they're playing with. No. Oh, there's a windsock. Dang. No, okay, you can't get up there. It's not a, a secret. Or maybe it's not a secret thing in the demo. Okay. Are you person? No, you're just a bunch of cogs. Excellent. And. This, this really feels like the end of that biome. So going in here, it will, yeah, back to the Ark. Congratulations on surviving this far. Thank you for playing our little appetizer. If you enjoyed the experience and want to support us, be sure to add Windblown to your Steam wishlist right now. It means a lot to us, and hey, it helps our supposed friend, the recommendation algorithm. Supposed friend is right. See you on October 24th, two days from now. Presumably at 6 p.m. BST. That is usually when it happens. Anyway, I'll see you on then when more characters, weapons, challenges, and special powers await you. Not to mention co-op. So get ready to leap into the vortex with your friends. There we go. Create by motion twins. And... Yeah. 
Yeah, I recognize some of those names from uh, the other one. Okay. Can I spend all those cogs that I've got? Yes, I can, but I'm going to come back here and I'm going to be sick again, am I? I'm not, not going to press anything. I don't mind seeing it once, or, you know, one out of every X number, just to show, hey, this is a trying thing on your body. But every time, screw off. Back so soon, let's see if we can back. I still don't have enough of that. Alright, yeah. I can get variant bait. I could keep playing, because I can get health plus two at 200 and presumably there's health plus 3 as well just in case you're so bad like me that you can't defeat the boss but yeah you could unlock that one and presumably two more health flasks and then get whatever these threes are which may still not be in the demo but I don't know a steady matrian hair rope perfect for adventure Additional bi each biome has an optional challenge that gives an additional reward. Learn to navigate updrafts and unlock access to secret areas. Broken food j jars sometimes contain food. Something mysterious. Reroll. Allows you to reroll proposed choices during expedition for a few shells. Gain an additional gift slot for a total of four. Okay. Presumably we only had three then, I didn't notice. Because, you know, we only found one gift each run. Hexhorse. A Hexhorse will spawn in your expeditions, providing strong effects that always with detriments. Shell Reserve. Preserve up to a hundred shells when you die. Nice, yeah, okay. This is very much Dead Cells again, but this time 3D. Uh, transform gear on the ground into shells. Starting trinket. Receive a trinket at the start of your expedition. Nice, so you could get goo bombs or something. And health flask. Use it twice. Well, there we go. Um Hello, strike while the iron is hot. Yeah, memory database has been updated. Oh, I can buy the heavy blade. Slow but powerful weapon. Last attack deals crit and stuns. And it's in the demo. Alright, well let's have it. There we go. And then it'll be over here get it and then we'll try it over here. Hello. Wow, that's a lot of damage. And that is a lot of damage too. Hmm. I'm, I'm debating... You know what, okay, we're, we're, we're going to finish that here. Alright, but I don't know. No, okay, we're going we're gonna to end the whole stream here. Yeah, having finished that one. I was debating putting up Dead Cells as well, so we could, you know, just have a quick run through that and see the differences and similarities between them. But I'd have to... Whoop, I'd have to work around it and um, I don't know how well it is but yeah I don't know what size it is on my screen and I have to readjust it all and blah 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 and that's not worth doing right now for like a, a 10 minute look at Dead Cells. So yes this, uh, he said looking at things, this this is where we're going to end for the day. So yeah, so um, I hope, it certainly has piqued my interest in Windblown so I, I, I hope Maybe you've got a taste of whether or not it will. It is what you want, and yeah, and this is the last demo that we'll be doing for Steam Next Fest because it ends at, in like eight hours, and uh, yeah, I I am happy with some of the ones that I've got, and happy that I found out that some of the ones which were on my list are not things I ever want to look at again. So yeah, I'm glad. I'm glad I got to look at them. But yeah, I, it's a shame that it happened the week that my, or started off the week that my internet was all rubbish. But hey, there we go. What you gonna do about that? So, um, 
let me just say thank you for having been here. Yeah, well, well, thank you first. That is always important to do. Whether you're here live and in person or later on on the VOD, the fact that you spend any amount of time here with me means that I appreciate you. You're amazing. Never let anybody tell you any different. Do all the demos go away? No. Some of them do. And which ones go away, and how you can tell if the demo goes away, is just up in the air. I have no idea. I had um, uh, Vampire the Masquerade Coteries of New York? I forget which one it was, but there, were, there was one. No, I think Coteries is, is the full game that we played. I can't remember, but there was one which I had a demo for on there. And I didn't get to play it during the, the next fest. And then I still had the demo on my thing, so I went, ah, I'll try and play it. And it was like a week after the, the next fest. And it went, no, you don't have access to that demo anymore. You have no license for it. And it was like, tell me. I mean, at the very least, tell me that I don't have a that it will go away in a week. Or that I do not, or if you can't do that, tell me that I don't have access to it anymore, so it's not just taking up space on my hard drive or SSD. But yeah, uh, annoying still. Yeah, um, bruh. all right. Um, I can't remember where I was before that now. Uh, yeah, uh, this is this is probably the most interesting one to me so far so yeah I am looking forward to seeing more of this although uh, the question is do I want to buy it on Steam or on GOG and is it coming out on GOG at the same time that the Steam one is because it's early access if it's coming out on GOG then I'll pick it up there because I would much rather as Steam have made clear now that you buy a license to the game, not the game itself. Whereas on GOG, you own the game. So even if they, uh, if if Steam dies, I think you probably lose access to all your games. I don't know for certain, but yeah. But if GOG dies, then you can at least have downloaded the backup installers beforehand and still have access to them. So yeah, I don't know. And of course, I've got Dead Cells on GOG, so I would. Uh, like to continue with it in the same place. But I don't know that that's going to happen. So, but anyway, um, we will be back tomorrow. And tomorrow, when it would be Fallout 4, we're going to instead be looking at Alan Wake 2, the, uh, the Lake House DLC, which will have dropped. Hopefully. At least it's planned to have dropped before then. So, yeah, we will be looking at that. Come back here for more spooky scares tomorrow. Um, and then we will be streaming on Thursday, where we'll probably be doing Fallout 4, seeing as we won't have done Fallout 4 twice this week. And there will be no stream on Friday. So stream on Thursday, no stream on Friday. Alright? I hope you can make it here for one, some, all, whatever amount of streams you want to be here for. Because, as I already said, but I have to reiterate, I do appreciate you being here. Thank you very much. Ah, but as I said, until the next time, I have been Richard, and this whole thing around us. Why, that has been LMTDTMFFR, or say it with me now, limited time offer, no vowels, and you, you have fun, and whoops, stay weird. Oh, I pressed that early. Never mind. Bye.